So entrepreneurs usually fit into one of three categories when I first meet them. So they usually are either an ostrich, a juggler, or an air traffic controller. Mm. So the ostrich would be an entrepreneur that would say to me something like, you know what, Jim, I don't have time to worry about all this wealth planning stuff. I'm taking care of my family. I'm living my life. I'll get to it. And it's easy to be the ostrich. You just mm. ignore and avoid, but the results are almost always poor. Right. Then there's the juggler. That's the entrepreneur that says, I know I'm handling all this stuff on my own. I've got all these balls in the air. I'm dropping balls left and right, but I'm just doing the best I can. Mm. You can imagine it's hard to I be bet. the juggler, but the results are usually poor. Then there's the air traffic controller. And the air traffic controller is the entrepreneur who has amazing professionals in those areas of tax, legal, insurance, and investment. But the entrepreneur is managing the team. So that is the step between you move from ostrich and juggler to air traffic controller. And that's where you need to go first. Then when you can afford to hire a firm to actually run that team for you, that's when you move to the best situation because the air traffic controller is hard, but you can get excellent results. But from there, you move to the family office structure where now you have these excellent professionals on that wheel, but you're not in the middle of the wheel anymore managing it. 